Another big story takes us to the East Bay tonight. A neighborhood is just in shock after a woman was shot and killed along Saginaw Circle in Pleasanton today. This is video from that scene. Police are investigating the situation, but say the woman was found with multiple gunshot wounds. That shooting led to a chase, and that chase ended with a complete shutdown of Interstate 580. Crown Force Gail Ong is live for us tonight at the scene along the freeway. Gail, what's the latest? Yeah, Grant, just steps away from that scene and that investigation, I'm told, is just about to wrap up here, and all lanes on 580 should be reopened by the hour, but this is just one piece of that murder-suicide investigation. Investigators spent the day focusing on the sedan on the westbound shoulder of 580. According to the California Highway Patrol, the call came in from Pleasanton Police just before 1130 in the morning Thursday. They were requesting assistance. Their officers were actively in pursuit of a known murder suspect on 580. Pleasanton police responded to a home on Saginaw Circle. Around 11 a.m., a woman was found inside the home with multiple gunshot wounds. The suspect was seen driving away and was followed by Pleasanton police in an unmarked vehicle. A pursuit ended here in San Leandro near the Benedict Drive exit. The driver, a suspect in a murder-suicide case, died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. The suspect vehicle, while in pursuit, crashed. And at that point, there was a high-risk stop as well as a standoff for approximately 30 minutes. Uh, with the combined efforts of all allied agencies, it was determined that the suspect had succumbed to his own injuries. Officers took measurements and diverted traffic as they pieced together what led to both crimes. And we're told Pleasanton police will be handling the murder-suicide investigation. Meanwhile, back here live, we're here on 580 westbound, just in front of the Benedict Drive exit. We're told police are just wrapping up their investigation. All lanes should be back reopened sometime within the hour. Live here in San Leandro, Gail Ong, Cron 4 News. Gail, thank you for